after stamping with the Versamark and embossing with the gold embossing powder and punching it out with the decorative label punch, we will add two dimensionals to the back side and we will now add that to our card. And before we do that, we're going to take the metallic thread that we've gathered up and hooked together with a glue dot and place that down on the DSP. However it lands, it looks pretty good. And then we'll add the Marion Bright greeting on top of that. And that's the front of the card. So let's do the same and create the back of the card, the inside of the card. The inside of the card is much or less the repeat of what you've done on the outside with four stamps of snowflakes in each corner and the Merry Christmas greeting all embossed with the gold embossing powder stamped with Versamark. I also used a dauber that was stamped with the gold Encore ink and I burnished the edge of this card so that it would be outlined a little bit more and that you could see the uh, edge and bring it to life and not be so white on the edges. So let's put this card together. All we're going to do is take the back and add snail. to the inside of the card. And we will also add snail to the completed face of the card. That's it. You have a beautiful Christmas card um, that you can use uh, for this coming 2015 Christmas season. Um, and if you choose to buy any of the products that I mentioned, um, you can buy them and make your own Christmas cards and continue this fun um, job. So all of the products that are shown in this video are from my webpage on Stampin' Up! called Stampin' Joy at stampinup.net or off my blog at barbspaperpizzazz.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you for the next video. Bye bye.